Hey, hey everyone. So we are in the classic vertical. Um, starting June 1st through June 7th. And let's get planning. I always love when the start of months being on Mondays. I just feel like everything just kind of flows better that way. So what I will be using today are some stickers from the DEK Designs, the, their May sub box. And then I have the Carpe Diem and I need to grab some washi. So this is the washi I grabbed so it has pineapples on it that are gold foiled and then kind of a floral leaf that um, has white. So we're gonna lay down the washi first and we're gonna actually leave there is um, down here some yellow we're actually gonna leave that because that is kind of a nice um, element since yellow is going to be one of their colors. I'm going to grab my X-Acto knife and my cute little <laughs> Betty Boop bag. It was an Ipsy, I can't remember what month it was. So slicing that off. And slicing this one off. I really like this um, happy planner because it has for every month it's kind of like seasonally designed so like this one is for the month of June so it has um, like flamingos so it's very summery so I'm definitely a fan of it which is kind of a bummer that there wasn't anything that was that appealing to me for the last like I mean for the 18 month or even the um, whatever can't can't think right now. <laughs> so trying to think of what's the easiest way. So I saw a lot of people doing this with their washi and I think it's a really great way to incorporate the washi. Cause otherwise, I mean, I feel like washi kind of, it's like still popular, but people don't use it in, in their spreads as much as stickers these days. Can't even see what I'm doing. Um, so yeah. kind of just you just make a little make it like a little banner doesn't have to be perfect but I think it's really cute and it adds for like where you put your weekend banner if that's the way I'm kind of changing my planning style a little bit um, kind of just figuring out what I want because I want multiple things so it's like I want one that's very functional it just tells me like my to do's for the day and then I want one that's very like decorative and cute um, like with lots of stickers so it's like a memory but kind of one so it's just just trying new things Seeing what sticks. Okay. I think that's it for the washi. I think that's really cute. So now for the stickers. 
We are going to be taking these. So I'm gonna take these ones that say Littles. Good. I was also wondering, has any of you used done kind of liquid that is supposed to um, help with like removing stickers? I'm just curious on how how it works and if it's good. Like, is it? I feel like it's just scary because you're like you need to put like liquid, right? I don't know. It's weird how one side's kind of like perforated, but it's not. Hmm. Kind of weird. Guess it's the way the machine cut it. Almost done. So yeah, so. Um, it's about my planning is that, yeah, I'm so, you know, for the month of May, I did, and actually this planner, um, memory planning. So that was good practice. Um, so for starting in July, I'm going to have a dedicated memory plan, um, planner, and I'm going to be using the, um, I believe the rec recollections just due to budget and I don't know if I'm gonna like it so since I'm used to always using a happy planner. So I figured might as well just try something that's more affordable. And so if I don't like it, then it's not that terrible and then I could get, um, you know, use a discount code because that would be awesome to save a little bit of money on that. So we got the littles down. Then let's see. I'm trying to think of what. I don't have actually a sheet that goes with these colors for like the littles but I could just write them how about that so and then up on the top I will be doing to do's yes yeah, so now these ones We're moving a lot better. So it's kind of weird. So I've actually started designing, <laughs> well, trying to, right? Um, my own stickers. Because I kind of want to open up a shop that will specialize. I guess not specialize, but sell stickers and charms for your planner, paper clips with the charms, and then the lobster clasps with the charms. And so I'm kind of into that. So I'm working on getting some stuff designed. I know like, I guess the competition or there's a lot out there. So really getting sales is gonna be more difficult, but Figured, you know, might as well try, right? So I'm gonna put errands. Yeah, on Saturday. 
tan sundae. So the way I'm actually planning this week is very similar to what you would do um, like if you're using like the sticker kits. So it's going to be kind of nice, I guess, practice. But I've also, you know, I'm following a lot of people and the ones that use like the sticker kits, a lot of them have changed their style um, to be more, I guess, like memory planning and they don't use like the checklist really that often anymore. So it's kind of interesting to see how the planning style has changed over the years and like foil is big and all that stuff. It's kind of weird that this paper is definitely different than this. I wonder if that's why this is cut kind of strange. Hmm. And then, okay, so these are some full boxes. So I'm going to add and since these are not made for the Happy Planner, so they are going to be a little short. Put that one there. Strawberry lemonade. Cute. And then I'm going to do one more. That's the hard part about I feel like stickers is that you want to keep them and not use them. But it's like you kind of have to use them because you bought them, right? I don't know. Just my thinking. So we're going to add the work ones. Cutting off this weird part that didn't come off. And then I'll just put underneath um, the hours that I'm working which are the same Monday through Friday. So it's not that important, but at least it will be marked down. And I actually missed Last week's, um, I didn't do a vertical or a classic size. I just did my uh, mini Monday last week, so I need to get back in the game. Okay, and then I wanted a weekend banner, which I wonder if one of these has, I don't know, but this is really cute. It says make every moment count. I don't know, put it under errands because that's just whatever, right? Um, What am I looking for? Weekend banner? No. But I think actually in the kit I might have one. Ah, yes. 
I'm gonna also do a little decoration. So for littles, like planning. Yeah, I'm surprised I actually didn't use any of these um, when I did my spread. There's Colton's birthday, so. I guess how I'm gonna do it is to-dos will be like to-do lists, like chores and stuff like that. Then I have my work. Then they're just gonna be just probably random stuff there. And the littles will be like kind of cutesy little things, I guess, kind of maybe like memory. That's how I'm gonna also have it. So, yeah. So I kind of like that idea. I'm kind of incorporating two different I guess style, so functional, but then also memory. Um, errands. Kind of like the pens. Because you gotta write down what you gotta do, right? Okay. Awesome. And I think I'm not doing date covers because colors work. Oh, here was another weekend dinner. Um, oh, the birthday. Oh, here. I was like, I know there has to be one. Oh, I already did the present. Oh, well, okay. I need the fuel up for sure. I'm going to put that to do because I, I need to get gas before before work on Monday I'm putting it down below and I think that is it for this plan with me I think it turned out really cute and I enjoy it and thanks for watching <laughs> until next time bye